Mix is presented by Gumatasa Coffee House, specializing in fresh local favorites. Located across Kayla and Manila. Find them on Facebook. All for day and welcome back. Now break out your calendar. Look at Saturday, July 26, and cross it out because that night you're going to be attending the 2014 Electric Island Festival. Here's everything you need to know. The wait is just about over. It's the event everyone has been talking about. It's the second installment of the Electric Island Festival, Guam's electronic dance music concert presented by Tropical Production and the 6AM Group based out of Los Angeles. 6AM group member, DJ, and local boy, Jio Wang, talks about the success of the inaugural EIF. We knew it was going to do well, but we really didn't think that it was going to bring that much energy and that much fun into the island, you know. Um, it was just very surreal to me. You know, it's, it's been a concept that we've been working on, and we weren't really sure of how the island was going to react to us. So it was, a, it was a great feeling. I was very, very happy with the turnout, and it really gave us the boost of confidence that we needed. TPI Promotions Manager Matt Scrow shares the same sentiment. It became so big because it, it was new to a lot of people. Um, the only people who have really experienced an EDM event to this magnitude were people who have gone off island for college, or maybe they went to go um, watch an EDM event in Asia. But the fact that it was home, I, I know that's probably contributed to some of the success for me. Now both promised this year's EIF to be a lot more colorful, taking it to another level by adding an amazing visual experience to include bringing lasers from off island and also hiring a visual director to build content as well as a VJ. The location this year also adds to the event's excitement. We wanted to do something different. We wanted to bring something different to our community. So. Like I said, we've done Guam Live at Paseo Stadium, we've done concerts at Leo Palace, we've done concerts at Jigo, but this whole EIF event is a very special and unique event. So what we want to do is bring it to a very special and unique area. And what better place than the, the heart of Guam in Aganya at uh, Paseo Riverside. And get a load of the awesome musical lineup. The headliner is Funk Agenda, um, global international artist. You know, she's played at EDC Vegas, Ultra Music Festival Miami, you know, clubs in Ibiza, just really all over the world. He signed a tour room records and actually owns his own label called Funk Farm, which has his own roster of artists as well. And he recently was signed to Armin Van Buren's label um, Armada, and the new release came out and it's doing very well. Our co-headliner this year is DJ Koo from Korea. He is actually the resident of Ultra Music Festival Korea, the ambassador as well. Um, although he's from Korea, he actually has a lot of international exposure, playing in you know Marquee New York, UMF Miami, and various clubs in Vegas as well. Um, then we're welcoming back Clyde Harris, who is part of EIF, um, DJ Supaji, who is originally from Guam and now doing very very big things in Seattle. And this EIF is his official homecoming, so a lot of people are very very excited for his set. So am I. Local DJs Ronnie Perez, Eric Shea, Gio Manzer, aka Ray Mac, and of course Gia round out this talented group who are definitely going to keep everyone dancing and positive. EDM is a music genre that is widely accepted across the world and continuing to thrive on Guam. It's in Asia, it's in the US, it's in Europe. I mean, it's really a global movement and we're just really excited that Guam is now part of it. And there are some heavy industry people in the US. Um, I know in LA there are a lot of it industry people who are now looking into the island and there are also a lot of um, industry promoters in Asia now looking into the island and being very curious and you know we couldn't be more proud I mean I think coming from Guam everybody is always um, has a lot of island pride anything that you know Guam is a part of people are just very proud of so this is something that's you know it goes beyond it than just the popularity of EDM now this is us saying that hey we are here we're from Guam we want to be heard, and I think we're slowly moving forward into that vision and goal. According to Scro, EIF tickets are almost sold out. Don't delay. Buy your tickets now at all Shell gas stations, Crowns Guam, ITE locations, MWR, Anderson ITT, or TPI.Guam. It's $30 in advance and $40 at the door, and we do suggest that you get there early. I think the buzz and the anticipation is there. Um, the only message that I have is, hey, everyone who is 18 and over are welcome 
do not feel you are too young or too old for this event. Um, we welcome everyone with open arms, you know, and this is really a platform for the people of Guam to just be themselves, you know, have fun. We all have problems and issues in our daily lives and the people who organize EIF, you know, we're also normal working people, nine to five. We have bills to pay and all that, but this event is really a platform, you know, for, for us to push the local millennials into another boundary and so that, you know, everyone can just forget about, you know, all their problems for once and just all come as one island, united as one, under one, I guess, beautiful sky, under the stars, and come on and have a good time. Well, we definitely hope to see you there. Don't go anywhere because we have the Guam Guide with Jessica Peterson when we return.